When you purchase and use Microsoft 365, you receive a monthly or annual invoice that summarizes all your charges for your subscriptions. Your invoice is a PDF file that contains a billing summary and billing information for each type of subscription that you have. The billing summary is the first page of your invoice and shows you general billing information, such as who to bill the services to, order details, such as the billing period, a billing summary of the charges, and payment instructions. Next, you'll see payment information for each of the products you have a subscription for. This includes new charges, previous charges, and changes during this billing period. And if your subscriptions don't have new information in any of these areas in the billing period, you won't see it in the billing statement. The New Charges section shows you the charges, discounts, credits, and taxes were added over the last service period. For example, it shows you the number of licenses during the service period, the price per license, and the number of days in the service period. The Previous Charges section shows a credit for charges you paid for during the previous invoice. For example, if you added or removed a license during the previous billing period, the invoice shows any charges or credits associated with those changes. The Changes During This Billing Period section shows you any changes to your subscription made during this billing period. For example, if you added or removed licenses during this billing period, it shows the types of changes you made and when they occurred. If you have any questions about your invoice, call the phone number or visit the website provided on the bottom of your invoice.